Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Here I will provide the Coursera Machine Learning Week 5 assignment with the easiest and the simplest method. You can do it within 5 minutes. So without delaying, let's get started. So I'm going to do this with Octave. So first of all, you need to install Octave. I hope you all know the usage of Octave. If you don't know how to install, you can check it out my previous videos. So after installing the Octave, you have to go to the directories in octave browse directories click on it now you have to just go to the folder machine learning folder provided by machine learning gif then you have to extract in a folder i think all you know after that you have to select the exercise 4 ex4 means week 5 assignment select this folder after selecting this folder go to file open here all the .m files remember all the .m files only don't select the leave So here we go your all .m files has been opened successfully now your task is to code if you know coding that gets but if you don't know how to code then i will uh, i have provided a website in my description so go to the website and here you will get all the codes don't copy it blindly first understand then copy it so check the file name carefully sigmoid gradient .m just copy this code here you have to find that sigmoid.m and paste the code after pasting the code you have to remember uh, select control plus s you have to do this same task for every files don't forget to save any of these files so after that copy this code rand initialize weights dot m go to the file each of the after pasting each of the file surely select control s now go to nn cost function dot in Now go to the nn cost function dot m. Actually, I am doing this with one hand, uh, and the other hand I kept the microphone. So that is why it is little bit mistaken. So after doing all this, now you have to just go to the submit.m remember here you have to just click on this button save and run check this button and click on it now go to the command window here you can see it is asking uh, 
used token from the last successful submission actually i have uh, submitted successfully previously that is why it's shown like me in your case it will ask for the email you have to provide the registered email which you have provided in coursera after that it will ask for the token that has been given by coursera and boom guys you will get 100 percent uh, definitely i have also got 100 percent so hope you guys understand if you still have any problem or face any issues then feel free to comment me uh, for more technical videos stay connected with me subscribe please thanks for watching